Good morning, y'all. So living room is in disarray right now while we give a makeover, do like a little remodel of the second bedroom, AKA the future uh, production office, content creation office, or what have you. Right now I'm in my studio room. As you can see, it's a mess in here, guys. So right now what I'm getting ready to do is break down this drum set because it's pretty much taking up all this space and it's gonna have to get broken down anyway if I want to get my floors done. So the first thing I gotta do is break down this kit. That is the other half of what's taking up the majority of the space in this room. Now, in case you don't know, this is my Mapex Armory Custom six piece kit i've had this kit for quite a few years it will be with me for the rest of my life god willing building it up and playing it is great but breaking it down huh oh my gosh let's just say this is a whole nother job it's called a roti or something like that Okay, so I guess we can stage this stuff in the bathroom. Don't nobody use it anyway. A few moments later. Okay, y'all. So excited to announce this is the room. After about an hour of getting everything up out of here, man, y'all see the work that needs to be done. Look at these dirty walls, man. Come on, bruh. Oh my god. It just feels so much better already. Now Next thing we're gonna do is throw some fresh paint on the walls. We're gonna be painting the walls in here white. Uh, first things first, we gotta put some painter's tape up and all that jazz. Whew. All right, y'all, so I guess it's safe to say your girl must have attention deficit disorder or something because as you can see, I done started painting the room tonight. I know I procrastinate a lot when it comes to other things, but the truth of the matter is, when I really want to get something done, I want it done when I want it done. So, I done went to Home Depot, then I got two gallons of white paint, done put down my painter's tape along the edge. I don't really care about getting paint on the carpet because the carpet is about to come up anyway. And I just done started like pretty much like all the hard parts that's going to get on my nerves. So when I come back in here and try to finish it tomorrow, at least all the hard parts are out the way. All right, y'all, so uh, we're gonna stop right here real quick, just to give you guys an idea of how much we got done. First of all, the time is 10.04, and I do have to be somewhere at 11, so I'm gonna try to hurry up and show you guys this, but as you can see, um, the majority of like the main parts of the walls are done now when we come back we'll have to you know hit the the nooks and crannies we gotta hit the top of the wall all of those right over here where my led light switches are we gotta finish that obviously we're gonna have to paint behind the curtains and the curtain rod and just finish the tops but for the most part um i would say like the hard parts are almost done this is kind of where we ran out so we'll finish that and then with the extra paint, we'll just use it as, you know, more coats of paint on the wall. So um, I would say we came pretty far for sure. We can finish this up today 
if not today tomorrow but knowing me we gonna finish it up today so yeah i'm gonna go hop in the shower now um kind of covered in paint a little bit i mean i just washed my hands but check me out y'all yeah there we go covered in paint all right y'all so this is pretty much the end of the painting phase as you can see got the whole room painted carpet is pretty messy but it's okay because we're ordering some new carpets to put in this room and we're really gonna get the vibe going the way it's supposed to be going now i'm not even gonna hold y'all to be completely honest i'm actually designing this room as i go as far as like ordering a carpet and stuff and trying to keep in theme with like the red curtains and stuff like that like i still kind of want to make the theme red but i'm just trying to figure out you know how i really want to situate this room so we're gonna see um trying to just see like you know what all do i want to put in here besides the desk and the, the speakers and music equipment and stuff like that like what goes back here in this back part you know like i i don't really know i ain't even gonna hold you after painting the walls, I don't feel like removing the carpet myself or doing none of the flooring myself. So what I'm about to do is see if I can go to Home Depot and find some Mexicans that can come in here and remove the carpet for me for like 50, 50 bucks or something like that. 100 bucks. I don't know. I don't think it's a hundred dollar job, but maybe we'll see. see what they got down here. Trash roofing. All right, let's see what they got. Demolition, hauling, cleanup, trash removal. <laughs> you guys know how to remove carpet off the floor? Hi. You know how to remove carpet off the floor? Yes, but me and him. For $100, I have one room. Okay, one room. How many guys do you need? Huh? How many guys do you need? How many? Just to remove the carpet or what? Take it off the floor and take it. Take the carpet? Yeah. Oh. I got a hundred bucks. It's one room. It's not very big. Did you know how much it cost me in the dump? In the dump, you have to pay $80 minimum. It's the minimum in the dump. You have to pay $80. What, what dump are you taking it to? Excuse me? What dump are you taking it to? Oh, right here. Just take it to my dumpster. You're not taking it to the dump. You're just taking it to the trash can in my neighborhood. Okay, and your, and your house. You, you want to leave it in the house, right? There, no, the you're going to take it to the dumpster in my no, neighborhood. Oh, no, it's not that's far. A, no, that's it. Oh, you, for my job. Oh, you need truck, right? Okay. Do you want to pay 200 No, I'm paying $100. You're not going to take it to the dump. Because you're taking it to the trash I can. You You're not taking it to the dumpster though. I don't want you to take it there. You're gonna take it to the dumpster in my neighborhood. Okay, so do you want to do it? I got it. One fifty. No, a hundred dollars. Look, let me show you. Let me show you the picture. This is the room right here. It's not even that big. So I just want to take this off the floor. And we, I want to take it. I can take it to my own trash can. You don't even just cut it up until I can take it downstairs. That's it. Hundred okay, bucks. This, this I got in 150. It's a hundred. Uh, 150. Uh, maybe. It's a hundred, bro. That's all I got. Hundred. No, this. Solo this, tiene hundred. So it's a hundred. For one person, I don't need all three. This is not a three-man job. <laughs> if you want, I can help you. Just, just take it up the room. That's it. Just, just take it but then you can you cut it up too so I can so so I can so I can carry it to the dumpster. Let me put it in part. No, I don't have trouble. No, I'm saying can you cut it so small and I'll take it myself. Yeah, okay, okay. It's an eight by ten room, bro. Uh, one fifty. It's a hundred, bro. <laughs> so you want to do it for a hundred, bro? You? But just just cut it and leave it. Just take it up off the floor and cut it. I'll take it myself. House, you're leaving. Or in your trash can. Oh, 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 so just okay. take it off the floor and just cut it in small and I'll take it. I'll dump it myself. Okay, okay. Right. I, I, I want hungry. I got it. I you got it. Yeah. Now he got it. Okay. Okay. So I might have to do the floor leveling myself, man. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Buddy talking about he only go to the best for self leveling, but I'm like, bro, self leveling ain't hard. That's why it's called self leveling. It levels itself. All you gotta do is mix it and spread it out on the floor. 
I did that from my um, master bedroom and like it came out great. All right, y'all, so this is what's left. Once the guys got all the carpet off the floor, this is what's left of it. Uh, these little streaks you see, just streaks of glue. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come in here, sweep up real good one time and um, scrape some more yellow padding off the floor as much as we can. And then we're just gonna self level this thing ourselves. We're just gonna do it ourselves. Um, I'm not even gonna put border tape down along the edges this time because there's no need, man. I don't know if this floor is already level. To be honest, it looks pretty level already, but we want it to match the bedroom, so we're just gonna do it ourselves. So I'm gonna walk out through the process of how to get that done while the paint is still drying. Paint job looks wonderful. There is one spot up here that I wish I would have hit a little bit more, but we gonna cover that with curtains anyway. You're not even gonna be able to see that. But everything else looks amazing. So once we get this floor done, then we can really kick our feet up and chill. Got a lot of flour. Just got out my cold shower. Pack a big bowl of sour. Smoke my own brand of flour. Look down and wave to all the doubters. Hello, bitch. <laughs> if you think you've got advice for me, keep it to yourself. These bitches all think they so tight with me. Shit. Please tell me what you did. And I'm not talking about 500k likes on your pick, bitch. Y'all stay stressed about exterior. Hot girl, water brains inferior. Whoa, bitch, and my heart superior. Flow sick, ill than bacteria. Serious. I kill it, that's on period. And I'm doing it prettier. Really though. Y'all stay silly though. I can never die. Got a lit spirit. So, we just finished the self leveling on the floors. As you can see, I did make a bit of a mess over there in the corner. But it's all right, man. This is my mess to make. It's my crib. You know what I'm saying? I'm proud of this job. I did what needed to be done and I can't wait for this to dry. It's gonna take about a day, maybe up to eight hours for the floor to really dry how I needed to, which is fine with me because I'm not gonna be here uh, for the day anyway. I'm gonna be gone for a few hours. So I just wanted to get this done this morning so it could be drying while I'm gone. And um, I'm excited y'all, super, super excited for what's to come with this. Uh, I can't believe I really just cemented my floor, bro. I really wish that I could have done it a little bit more neater, but you know what? It's all good, bro. Once I hit this with some paint, everything is gonna be back to normal. And I can't wait to show y'all the finished product, man. Oh, so proud of this and I'm so glad it's done. Perfect. Okay, so the moment you all have been waiting for, the grand reveal. Before we get into what it looks like now, let me show you guys what it looked like before. As you can see, we have the drum set on one end, the studio desk on another end. I like the aesthetic. If I were actively drumming, it would have been perfect. But I'm focusing on another part of my career right now. And so we have to make a room that's suitable for that. So here's what we got. So here it is. Um, we got the U-shaped desk 
right here in the back of the wall. Got lots of natural sunlight. I ordered a little content creation feng shui to go on the wall to make it seem a little bit more like an office, you know what I'm saying? We got the LEDs going around the top of the wall and the LEDs can be any color whatsoever. Um, looks for sure to be very artsy. I can definitely see myself doing more work in here. I've already set up my camera to see what these angles are gonna be looking like when I do shoot some videos, so I'm excited. Now, I know this still looks to be a bit cluttered, but that's just because currently I have housekeeping doing a deep clean on my house as we speak. Reason being is because after I self-leveled the floors, I didn't use enough water in the mix and I still left quite a bit of sand pebbles on the floor, so it got a little dusty. So I hired a professional cleaning crew to come in and just clean up the whole place, clean up all the dust from everywhere. But this is the room, you guys. As you can see, I went ahead and put a U-shaped desk in there, sold my studio desk, and we just gonna, I wanted to open it up a whole lot. Lots of natural sunlight coming into the room. We got LEDs around the wall. Now, while the housekeeping crew is cleaning, I am storing some stuff in the room, but once they leave, things will be back in place and the room will look what it needs to look like. But, uh, this is it, y'all. Now my job is to make sure I keep cleaning this room as frequently as possible because there was a lot of dust from when I did the self-leveling. And so that's why I got the cleaning crew in here. I just made a huge mess, but they gonna get it back straight for me, you feel me? Anyway, if you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching to the end. Be sure to like, share, and most importantly, subscribe to my channel because you know these future videos about to be lit in my new office. But either way, y'all already know how it goes. Till next time, peace.